captain and the number one ranked player against the Welsh captain himself, a former world champion, Leighton Rees. Well, Anderson took the first two legs, both pretty close though, and it's Rees to start the third. The commentator this time is Sid Waddell. The reigning world professional champion looking to kill this. It's the Eddie Edwards view of things. Really, just the odd centimetre out on that 60 score in Anderson. Slacked out by Anderson. 60. By his standards. Great chance for East to step in. 80. Unlucky. Need to sixty here. Sixty. England require one hundred and sixty. Possible three dot shot out. Sixty. Wins require one hundred and thirty five. For two one. England require 100. Could do in two dots, 60 in tops. Just outside the trouble 19. 40. Ways require 81. To save it. Double 12. Double 6. 75. England require 60. So Bob could put England ahead in the match. He wants 20, he wants tops. Double 10. That's a great attempt. Here So a comprehensive victory over Leighton Reese for Bob Anderson. Leighton couldn't take the chance. That chance is in the last leg. But Bob goes through and it's England ahead 2-1. No problem for the world champion and England went on to take their third set in a row when Gene Raymond, the Surrey player, had a fine win over Tony Skews by three sets to one and that made the match score also 3-1 to England. Well out came Keith Della, the 1983.